Hey Foundation 1s and 2s for this week's PE video. Um, first of all, I'll just go through very quickly what's going on. So you both, you all have a go noodle. Foundation have one video, 1s have another. Do what you've been doing, a little clear screenshot. Um, I understand obviously, um, if you don't have a second device it's hard to film. But if you do, cool, little clip, awesome. Um, send it through, so that way I know that you're doing it. Then, this week, we are up. Not using this. We're having a rest. All right. So, um, yeah, just give it a rest for a couple of weeks. Do some ball handling skills instead. That way, um, we'll come back nice and fresh for the end of the term. That's my idea anyway. Don't want everyone to do the same thing over and over and over and over. Um, you're all improving, and um, yeah, we'll go through everything that we've learned right near the end of the term. Today, though, you need. A ball. Or if you don't have an old tennis ball, you have a really big tennis ball if you got one. I've stolen this from my dog. Um, any sort of ball will work well. Preferably one of these. Um, you know how tennis balls work, so they're bouncy, they're good to catch. Um, if you require an easier ball, such as something like this, um, it doesn't necessarily have to be a tennis ball, um, but um, it can be basketball, or netball, softball, like a pool ball, they're all good. Now, you, may be able to hear my dog. He has just decided to start barking because he's seen me using this. So I'm going to hide this up here. You have a few things that I want you to do today. So first off, what I want you to do is you need preferably an outside area, but I understand that the weather's not looking too good this week. So hopefully you can do most of these things inside as well, as long as you're sensible. Check with mum and dad. If you got, even if it's raining and you've got an outside deck that you can do this on, it's really good. As you can see, I'm doing this on Tuesday. It's still sunny. It is a little bit windy, so I apologise if I'm a bit hard to hear. First thing I want you to do is bounce and catch. And I want you to do it 10 times. Okay? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Now, remember, if you catch it and the ball is coming back down, I want you to cup your hands. If it's coming up, I want you to show me your fingers, point your fingers to the sky sort of thing. Okay, now, so you've done 10 with two hands, I want you to do five with your right, five with your left, and then you are ready to go. Stretch, warm down, warm down. Alrighty. Now I want you to throw and catch in the air. So a decent size. This is one that might be a bit tricky inside if it does rain when you're doing this. So, go up here. One, two, three, and so on until 10. Um, then I want you to throw, clap, and catch. So we've done this in PE before. Five, six, seven, eight. Lost count, all right? So see how high you can go. If you don't catch it, it doesn't count. Only counts if you can do it. My dog is barking really loud because of all the clapping in the ball. This is not good, so I've got to get through this really quickly. What have I got to do now? Ah. If you've got a wall, that is awesome. That's awesome. It's something that you can throw against and it's gonna come back at reliable um, height and weight and depth and everything like that. It's gonna be really good. I've got a wall right here. So hopefully, you can see me. Check, yes, 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 that was on camera. Throw into the wall. Now, I always say, throw it underarm. Throw it underarm with a little bit of power behind. Because if it's underarm, we'll come back to you nice and, nice and, my dog is putting me off, which is very annoying. It'll come back at a nice height. If you do it over up, it'll just bounce back to you. And that's what you don't want. That you want to be have a bit of a challenge. Okay, just check my notes for the next one. Oh, this is the key one. I'm going to move something. Da, 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 da. I have my wheelie. Target. So I'm going to aim at a target. It doesn't have to be this big, you can find. Like, obviously, the idea with this is like cricket stumps. I don't have cricket stumps very well. I've got a bin because I'm at home. So I'm going to go as far as you can see on my driveway. Move this a little bit there. Yeah, you can see me. I'm going to see if I'm hit. Oh, I missed. Going to do that again. One more. Yeah. So 
So hopefully you saw that I hit. I'm going to get my dog. He's annoying me. So we've got the troublemaker here. Um, so, yeah, I want you to have a... Can you get out of the way? Sit down. Sit. <laughs> Never work with children or pets. Sit. Have the ball. There we go. Alright, so obviously I want you to aim at your target. Um, if you get it first time, it might be a bit too easy. Move back further, make it more of a challenge. And, um, yeah, if you could film me one of each that you do. One bounce catch, one bounce left hand, one bounce right hand, and make that a little clip at the end. That'd be awesome. Um, you like that, don't you? <laughs> and um, send it through to Cecil. That'd be awesome. Keep, keep the videos nice and short. I can get to all the kids really quickly um, rather than spending a big video. So try to keep about a minute worth of videos. Um, I apologize for my dog. He just had a nice little cameo and um, Hopefully we'll see you um, in the morning for our WebExes.